In 1950s, each computer maker used its own programming language. A 1959 survey had found that the programming cost 800,000 US dollars on average and that translating programs to run on new hardware would cost an additional $600,000. The same survey suggested that if a common business oriented language were used, conversion would be far cheaper and faster. In May 1959, Department of Defense held a meeting at Pentagon to discuss the creation of a common programming language for business. The DoD operated 225 computers, had a further 175 on order, and had spent over 200 million dollars on implementing programs to run on them. Portable programs would save time, reduce cost, and ease modernization. The representatives agreed that the language should make maximum use of English, be capable of change, be machine independent and be easy to use for inexperienced programmers. Committees were formed to devise such a language. The committee mainly examined the existing Flowmatic, Comtrom and AMCO programming languages. By September 1959, this new language was named COBOL, which stands for the common business oriented language cobol was 95% flowmatic which was developed by grace hopper the first program ran on 17 august 1960 in december 1960 the same program was run on two different computers demonstrating the machine independence of the language the computers were univac 2 and rca 501 computer this first specification of language was called cobol 60 